Hello everybody, my name is Zach, aka The Weather Gamer, bringing you another uh, weather tutorial. Last time we did uh, Gen 8 Rain, I'll link that video down below as well as that team. Um, this time we're going to do Nat Dex Rain, so this is everything, Gens 1 through 8. Um, it's going to be kind of a similar thing. Um, I'll talk about, basically I'm going to build my ideal rain team this time, uh, with the whole Nat Dex versus... Uh, what we talked about last time so it's gonna cover a lot of the same things um you got the post home moves and all that too uh you're still so with nat decks you have kyogre which is normally banned so if you're looking at this from a draft league standpoint kyogre's banned you're not gonna see um kyogre rain teams uh you can use pelipper again same way as i built last time um, you can run a Pelipper, Pelipper Rain team, or your other option is Politoed. I personally prefer Politoed. Like, I seriously prefer Politoed on Rain teams over um, Pelipper. I've, I've had way more success. Um, no, I'm sorry, Chesto. I've had way more success with Politoed over um Pelipper. Drizzle with chest resto chesto um just to give yourself some bulk um i my favorite set to run with this is the paris trap song um and then i usually give it ice beam um so i can hit grass types coming in i can at least chunk them obviously now tang growth is a huge issue um Tangrowth is one of the biggest rain killers out there, but um, Ice Beam. If it's Assault Vest, you at least get info. If it's Parish Trap, um, you at least get info. I usually run 252. Um, I usually run 100, and then I go 156 Bold. Um, that helps me take on um, the Tangrowth. Uh, generally... Generally, this is designed to whirlpool something, then um, perish song, trap it, and the goal is to live three hits, or live long enough that you perish trap them on out. So, Politoed here, um, that's kind of my thing. Again, you want a physical rain sweeper. Um... And a special sweeper. I have not had a lot of luck with physical sweepers or specials. I haven't had a lot of luck with rain, period. But um, as far as special sweepers, Kingdra is always considered the best rain sweeper. You have Seismitoad running special. You have Ludicolo, which is my preferred, um, my preferred um, Swift swimmer on the uh, special side. I love running it with Life Orb. Um, Assault Vest is another set that I've seen. I usually run Giga Drain, Ice Beam, Spexed is another set, Scarfed is another set, um, Hydro Pump, Ice Beam, Giga Drain, and that deals with bulky water types, that deals with bulky grass types. Electric type, I don't believe. You used to see Hidden Power Ground, um, but Hidden Power Ground, Hidden Power is removed, so you no longer see um, Hidden Power's run. What do I know? What's, what takes the place of Hidden Power? That's a good question now. What takes the place of Hidden Power with Hidden Power? Hidden Power is gone. You aren't allowed, most leagues aren't allowing Hidden Power. I know WWC isn't allowing Hidden Power. Um, we just we prefer it that way. Uh, what is going to be my fourth move? Let me just go look at Ludicolo on Smoke. Ludicolo. Or Smoggin, or whatever you want to call it. Let me go look there and see what they usually run. Um, as their fourth move. If it's Hidden Power, I'll have to figure something else out. They run Rain Dance for Manual Rain. Um... Bulky 
attackers. Okay, so basically it's just uh just uh what do I want to lead type thing. Or what I want to use type thing. Um Hmm. Returns also abandoned most leads now. Synthesis is not good in rain. Focus Blast, just because rain teams also tend to struggle with opposing steel types a little bit. Um, that way I can hit an opposing steel type potentially. Now on the physical side, okay, there are so many physical... There's Kabutops, which I have not had much luck with. There's Mega Swamper is considered the gold standard. Um, on rain teams, you generally run Mega Swampert, um, just because it, um, it just hits like a truck under rain. I am so tired of running Mega Swamper. I don't want to mess with Mega Swamper. I don't want to deal with it. Uh, just running max, max lead fill up. Um, so from a physical standpoint, I'm gonna try Dreadnought actually instead of Barrasquita. Um, because I did that with that. I want to try Dreadnaw. Dreadnaw. Um, let's go Gigantamax Dreadnaw. Just because this is, um, I know G-Maxing is probably banned, but, you know, for laddering, I'll do G-Max. Uh, Swift Swim. We're gonna give it, I'm gonna give it the Berry again. Um, just like I did, um, Doozer Floozer, uh, Seismitoad, because I'm quad weak to grass type hits, um, Earthquake to hit steel types, um, Liquidation for water types, Megahorn for grass types, and let's give it... I want the rock move over earthquake. I think I want the rock move over an earthquake. And Stone Edge, Invitation Mega Horn, and then Swords Dance. Because um, if you can get a Swords Dance up um, with this thing, and then G Max and Swift Swim is just going to rip through because you'll have Max Flutter. This will go to G Stone Surge, which is nice because it puts rocks up, allowing you to chip. And then Stone Edge just hammers. Megahorn also allows you to take out those really annoyingly bulky grass types like Hangrowth, um, unless it's physically defensive and maybe Cola can beat it. So that's your Rancor right there. I, I want the Volt Absorber, so I'm going to go with Zero Aura. Uh, Volt Absorb. Do I want to... What do I want to do? I'm going to give it Shook a Berry. Uh, because I don't actually... Well, I will have one, but I'm going to give it Shuka. Uh, no, I'm going to give it the Expert Belt. Expert Belt. Um, Plasma Fists. Play Rough. It gets this generation, which I really enjoy, because now I can hit um, Dragon Types. Close Combat to hit the... Um... Oh, what am I trying to hit here? Um... Play Rough is also nice because it'll hit Dragon uh, Dragon Bolt. Uh, phone, why you gotta do this? Uh, close Combat for Steel Types as well. Also very very good hit um, to hit the Steel Types with, and then Bolt Switch, so I can pivot around and get into where I need to go for. Um, like I can pivot into Politoed, I can pivot into a Rain Sweeper potentially. I can pivot into Dreadnought. Get the SD up, Gigantamax, and uh, Surge, or Megahorn, uh, Flutterby, whatever I need. Um, I'm going to run Max Attack, um, 
we're not going to run adamant nature. We are going to run max attack. We are going to run minus defense. I'll put four there. Plus, um, because this outspeeds Dragapult by one uh, speed point, which is really, really nice. Um, unless it gets a V-Dance or it's dark. Um, Polo, nice. Dreadnought. If Dreadnought doesn't G-Max, it's still really, really good. Um, I'm going to run maximum uh, speed here. Um, I'm not going to go fully attack invested, though, because of the Swords Dance. Two. I am going to run Adamant Nature, though. I'm going to give myself some bulk. Um, and we'll stick. This this is basically Kabutops, like a Kabutops type of set. Um, Dreadnought here. Dreadnought basically replaces Kabutops in most rain teams. Um, it would be my guess. Um, it's slightly slower than Kabutops, um, but it still does the job. Okay, there's their aura, so there's my electric problem. Um, what else do I want on this team? Corviknight for Do I want Corviknight? As a steel type? No, I don't want Corviknight as a steel type. Um I've got electric types checked. I would like to check up the bulky grass types. Bulky water types are checked. Steel typing is also another issue that I have to deal with. Um, oh, duh. Staple of real, my favorite, like, solid rankings is Talent Link. Uh, male. Without Z crystals, it becomes. Um, Gailings is severely, severely broken down as well. Again. Um, Roost, Brave Bird, Flare Blitz, uh, Roost, Brave Bird, Swords Dance. Oh, yes, new item. Heavy Duty Boots. And we'll give it default. So this is basically to break bulky grass types. Um or I could U-turn and just pick up Defog somewhere else. I don't even need U-turn. That way I have um, pivoting power. Heavy Duty Boots, I don't take the Stealth Rock damage, um, which is great because otherwise Talonflame just gets bodied. Um, two plus minus. I am running a lot of max max sets on this one. Uh, this just because I don't see the necessity in um, the other thing. Okay, now I need to chip and I need removal as well. I need to be able to chip things and I need to be able to remove from my side of the field. Um, Cinderace also is a pretty decent mod because you can core change with it, but I want. Rapid spin removal or rapid spin setter, and I know just what to do because it also deals with stealth rocks. I know I said you generally don't in the last video, you don't want um, focus ash, uh, mold breaker, stealth rock, rapid spin, earthquake. I know I said in the last video you don't want to run Excadrill, um, just because of the fact that Rain is just going to clean it out, but as a suicide lead on a Rain team, like this type of Rain team, it's not bad. Um, get off your rocks versus their rocker, then you spin your rocks away, potentially if they don't have the spinner. Um, the rocks are really nice chip. Um, the Rapid Spin gives you a speed boost. Mold Breaker Earthquake hits the Rotoms or any other Levitate Mon. Iron Head just hits 
decently hard. Um, speed stat wise, base 80 mons, I believe, hit without a speed boost, hit 263, so I want to run 264. I should count that and check it. Bulk and a little bit of attack investment, a little bit defensive nature, ambush nature, just be a bit of a leady tank, a little bit of attack investment. We're not going to be fully invested, um, that sort of thing. I don't like using specs and band and scarf if you haven't picked up on that. I don't like choice locking myself, but. I don't know. This, this to me, is a rain team that I want to try out. Um, just to see how it comes out. Uh, but you've got your rain setter, a special wall breaker, or a special sweeper can act as a wall breaker, a physical wall breaker sweeper. You've got your electric check. Um, you've got your bulky grass type check. You've got your bulky water type check. You've got your steel type check. Um, Dragon types, this team doesn't handle dragons very well. With Zero War play roughing them. Um, and relying on Ludicolo to ice beam them. That's about your best bet for checking up on the bulky steel types. But I don't know. I think this could work. Um, I'll take it out and test it. You guys can take it out and test it. Tell me what you think. Um, let me know. Leave a pokey paste in the comments down below if you've made. Uh, modifications to the team um, and found other stuff to work differently or better that sort of thing but yeah I think that's gonna be it I will take these out on the team or on the out on the ladder and I'll try them and all that but thank you guys for watching uh, please check out the links in the description down below and I'll see you guys next time Ooh.